Hi there, Dr. Gary here on the road. We sell dental practices nationwide. We are dental practice brokers, and I was a dentist for 25 years. And um, we've been doing the dental practice brokers now for 14 years. Today's topic is buyer panics because dental equipment salesperson tries to talk them into not buying an existing office, but starting from scratch. Ridiculous. We'll get into that today. So at this point, uh, we are open for you six, I think, uh, yes, from 8 a.m. till 9 p.m. Every day except Christmas and Easter. So just call us, even if you just need advice. We are here to help you. Okay. If you're thinking, and our phone number is 201 963 and our website is dentalpracticeguide.com or nationwide dentalpracticebrokers.com. So just give us a ring and we'll be more than happy to, uh, to assist you. Our phone number, once again, 201 963 dentalpracticebrokers.com. That's the website. You can go on a lot of information on there. Now, everything you're about to hear is for entertainment purpose only. So we have this one buyer that was really motivated about a practice. And we're going to have a long conversation about this to have not to get influenced by outside salespeople. Now, if you're thinking about selling to a DSO, call us because we work with them all the time. Uh, we're not employed by them, but we pick and choose who we think the best ones for you are. Now, the uh, they often will pay our, legal, our commission, so there's no commission to you anyway. And then when you work with us, we'll get your legal fees reimbursed upon successful closing. So call us, we can explain how that program works. Now, in addition, uh, today's topic is this young doctor is ready to buy an office and the equipment was workable. The doctor is doing half a million dollars. They're workable. And uh, a salesman gets into the, and the seller wanted to update, the buyer wanted to update a few of the things in the office. The seller gets her ear and decides to tell her, oh no, it'll be cheaper for you to completely start from scratch at a brand new office, which you can buy an office condo also and build everything from scratch. And the buyer asked me, what do I think about that? I said, well, you, you lose money. It's high risk. You're taking a chance. The transition of a dental practice from one to another compared to a startup, it's a lot safer and a better bet to go for a existing dental practice. You have the patients who are there, the staff are there. You can always replace a few of the chairs, do some minor renovations. So the the uh, the salesperson is trying to teach, to, to convince the doctor that, oh, no, no, it's going to cost maybe more to renovate than it is to completely gut it. I'm like, you got to be kidding me. I'm saying, I don't want to get on a case too much, but that's absurd. So, uh, you've got to listen to the right people. So what I then did is I had her speak to one of the bankers who I know has been involved in dental uh, financing and so forth for 30 years, knows everything about dental offices, building them all. Then I had another doctor who was well-seasoned dentist um, try to talk to her also and explain to her what you're trying to do is never going to work. This was a doctor. And the third one was a dental builder that just took a look at the emails and said, forget it. It's going to cost her a fortune. She's going to start off from scratch and it's going to take her almost eight months to build, maybe longer, depending on the landlord. There's no end to it. That's what it is. And uh, that's kind of where we are with that. We said no. My message for today's message is you've got to get your professionals. We'll give our advice. And this is an instance where the seller doesn't want to speak to, the buyer doesn't want to speak to the seller. Uh, she just wants to speak to third parties, me. Um, and that's where a broker comes in. But I brought in a banker and I brought in a dental designer that are both trying to uh, 
communicate with her. Don't take this chance of starting from scratch. No patients, no staff, because you had a beautiful, clean looking office. Don't just don't do that. So we'll see what happens. The message is you've got to speak to the third party, understand the role of the broker in between the buyer and the seller and the other craftsmen who could teach her, um, you know, tell her about dental practice, the, the banker that could teach the doctor about uh, the risk involved in the uh, startup from scratch, not using your existing clientele or patients and so forth. We'll get into that more. If you want to call us, give us a ring at 201-663-0935. We'll be happy to help you out. Thank you. Bye.